All right, guys. We're going to play our final game of Bullseye this evening. We're having a good time, y'all, aren't we? We are. Yes. Well, Kevin, you have $6,353,100, and you're playing against Adam Oliver. How you doing, Adam? I'm doing, I'm doing great. Thanks for having me back again. No problem. Well, you'll get to try to stop Kevin. So good luck to both of y'all. Here are the final eight categories we're dealing with, and they are the following. Rough Window, we have Life on the Farm, Casino Games, Art, arts and literature and 80s pop culture. And the right window we have hockey, mixed U.S. states, history, and the book of Exodus. There's the bottom window. Y'all know about that. That's the contract. And Kevin, I will start it. You tell me when to stop it. Knocking on Eric's doorstep. Stop! Here we go. We have Life on the Farm for $400. History for $200. And the contract is five questions. Which one you want? Mm. I'm going to try history, please. Going to try history. Okay, this contract is worth $1,000. Here is the first of the five questions. Consider, considered a heroine of France, how is Joan of Arc also known? Is it A, the maid of Orleans, B, the servant of Orleans, C, the savior of Orleans, or D, the mother of Orleans? She was known as the maid of Orleans. That is correct. Good job. $200 in the pot. Four more questions to go in order to complete the contract. How many stones... Make up the prehistoric monument Stonehenge. Is it A, 80, B, 120, C, 60, or D, 100? Uh, I'm going to say 100. 100 is wrong. I'm sorry. Oh, bummer. Adam, you can get in on this. How many stones make up the prehistoric monument Stonehenge? Is it A, 80? B120 or C60? Uh, so you kind of cut out a little bit. Okay, let me repeat the whole question. How many stones make up the prehistoric monument Stonehenge? Is it A80, B120, or C60? Um, is it is it 120? 120 is wrong. I'm sorry. It is 80. 80. So, we'll throw that question out. We still need four questions in this contract. It's back to you, Kevin. All right. Who was the first U.S. president to win the Nobel Peace Prize? Is it A, John F. Kennedy, B, Theodore Roosevelt, C, Barack Obama, or D, Harry Truman? Um, Theodore Roosevelt. That is correct. Good job. All right, four hundred dollars is in the pot. The most recent was Jimmy Carter. Yeah, three questions to go in order to, to complete the contract. Here it is: Muhammad Morse was sentenced to twenty years in prison. In which nature? Let's try again. Muhammad Morse was sentenced to twenty years in prison. In which nation? Nation in twenty fifteen? Is it A France, B Spain, C Turkey, or D Egypt? Egypt. Egypt is correct. Good job. Six hundred dollars is in the pot. Two questions to go in order to complete it. Okay. All right. The ivory white marble mausoleum Taj Mahal was. Okay. All right. He, All right. He straight. Oh, okay. Yeah. What was, sorry. Sorry what about was that? that. That's okay. Here's the question. I was called away. Oh, that's okay. Here's the question again, Kevin. The ivory right. white marble mausoleum. Taj Mahal was con was constructed in which century? Is it A, 18th, B, 19th, C, 16th, or D, 17th? I'll say 17th. 17th is correct. Good job. You know your history. One question to go in order to complete the contract. Here we go. When was the first Nobel Prize awarded? Is it A, 1901, B, 1922, C, 1880, or D, 1911? By 
my logic, I gotta say 1901. 1901 is correct. You completed the contract. Yes, sir. $1,000 is in the pot. Now you can bank the $1,000 if you want to, but Control will go back to Adam or leave it in there and start a new contract. I got too much writing on this. Let's go with a new contract. He's continuing. We're going to start the reels. You tell me when to stop it. Stop. Here we go. We have Life on the Farm for $300. Hockey for $300. And the contract is five questions. And they're both, and they're both card games, dice games. Which one you want? Boy, neither of these two are my strong suits, but I'm going to try, I'll try Life on the Farm. Life on the Farm, and whoever completes this contract will win the game in $2,500, okay? Okay, I'm going to roll the die, you tell me when you want me to roll it, Kevin. Go ahead. We have a two, and we're going to talk about goats. Goat, okay? And it's a noggin's choice question, so you get to choose which one you want from 1 to 30. Uh, let's try 1. Okay, we're going to stick with the goats. Let's roll it again and see if we can avoid getting the 2. The goat's not tall already. Uh. <laughs> All right. Good. We have Good the 2 again, so it's a noggin's choice, obviously. Uh, do you want to stick with the first one again? Yeah, sure. All right, let's keep rolling until we get a different number. Roll it. We have three. There we go. <laughs> three, okay. And uh, we're going to do question three in goats, okay? All right. A female dairy goat is a doe. A male is a buck. What is a baby goat called? <sighs> is it called a joey? A joey is wrong. It's wrong. Oh, oh. All right. Uh, um, Adam, you can uh, uh, steal this. A female dairy goat is a doe. A male is a buck. What is a baby goat called? Um, I, I believe it's called a kid. You take over, Adam. Good job. $1,300 is in the pot. Four questions to go in order to win the game. Tell me when you want me to roll it, Adam. We have a one, and we're going to be dealing with hay. Hay. Wait, let me show it. Let that clear. It's hay. Hey. Hey. At least a true or false, though. So, Adam, if you get this uh, right, you, you stay in control. Miss it, it automatically goes to uh, Kevin by default, okay? Hay bales are either big and round or... Or small and rectangular. Is that statement true or false? Um, I believe that's true. No, it's false. It is false. So you get the control oh. back automatically. It goes back to uh, Kevin automatically. $1,600 is in the pot. Three questions to go in order to win the game for somebody. Tell me when you want me to roll it. Go ahead. A two... And we're going to be dealing with herb and spices. Herb and spices. Okay, here's your question. Vanilla is extracted from what part of the vanilla plant? Is it A, the roots, B, the bark, or C, the seeds? The seeds is correct from Vanilla Beans. Good job. All right, $1,900 is in the pot. Two questions to go in order to win the game for somebody, okay? Tell me when you want me to roll it. Go ahead. We have a two. And we're going to be done with pigs. Pigs, okay? Yep, here we go. What is a female pig called, uh... Kevin, is it a hog, a sow, or a swine? Uh, 
Um, I would say it's a swine. A swine is wrong. Ah. All right, Adam, you can take back over. What is a female pig called? Is it a hog or a sow? I believe it's called a sow. That is correct. Good job, Adam. Oh, Adam. Well, Adam, here's the situation. One question to go. If you get this question right, Adam, you'll win the game at $2,500. Miss it, and if uh, Kevin gets it, he'll win the game at $2,500. Tell me when you want me to roll it, Adam. Okay. Roll it. A two again. And we're going to be dealing with pumpkins. So fitting. So fitting for this time. Pumpkins. <laughs> yeah. And this is for the game. Where do pumpkins grow? Is it A, on tree branches, B, on vines, or C, underground like a potato? I believe pumpkins grow on vines. You win the game, Adam. Good job. <laughs> Yeah. Well, Adam, how does it feel to get on the leaderboard for a change? Oh, it feels super. Well, you're on the leaderboard now. Great. $2,500, and hopefully there will be more money to come for you, Adam. And you're going to play the bonus island for a lot more money. Well, listen, Kevin, you played a decent game. You uh, still have your $6,353,100, and you're in second place, okay? Hey, I'll the five out of day. Adam's broken the ice, and uh, I'll just say to you, good game. You did well, and uh, there you go. Go get him. All right. Well, Adam, are you ready to play for $2 million? I'm ready. Here we go. Now, I will explain the rules to you. Since this is the, uh, this your first time up here in the bonus island, let me bring the game and... If you're ready, let's do the bonus island. All right, Adam. The rules of the bonus island is simple. The object is for you to get three bullseyes in any of your spins, okay? If you do that, we give you double the money that is in the pot and $100,000, okay? Now... There's various money amounts from $1,000 to $3,000, but the main thing is stay away from the lightning. You don't want to hit the lightning. If you hit the lightning, it's game over, and you'll lose any money that is in the pot, okay? Now, if you get three bullseyes on your very first spin, we're going to give you $2 million, okay? So, Adam... Without delay, this spin, this one spin is for $2 million. Whenever you're ready to stop the board, tell me when. Alright, come on, give me some bullseyes and stop. Here we go. Bullseye! $1,000 and... Okay, Adam, you have one bullseye. Good job. Now, for all we know, Lightning may be back there. We do not know that. Now, Adam, you have a choice. You, can, you have $2,000. You can take your $2,000 and add it to your total or risk it all for your second spin. All right, let's, let's spin again. He's going for it. Good luck. Come on, Adam. You can do it. Come on. Give me a pair of bullseyes. I love them bullseyes. Top. Here it is. $2,000 and another $2,000. Okay, Adam. You have $6,000 now. Now, same option apply. You want to take the $6,000 and walk away or risk it off for your third spin. Uh, let's keep going. Good luck to you. Come on, Adam. Get another bullseye. Give me some bullseyes. Come on. I love a pair of bullseyes. And stop. Here it is. $1,000 and $2,000. You're still in the game, Adam. Okay. $9,000. Okay, you can take the $9,000 and add it to your total. Or if you want to be daring again, risk it all for your fourth spin. Um, let's keep going again. He's going for it. Good luck. Yeah, that one. Come on, I 
another pair of bullseyes right now. Another bullseyes and stop. Here we go. We have $1,000 and another $1,000. He's doing well. $11,000, Adam. Now, you can take the $11,000 and walk away. Or if you want to be daring again, risk it all for your fifth spin. But go for it, Adam. Uh, there's... Oh, I think these cards are... Not quite my favor. Um... I think, um... I think, um... Comfortable taking another spin. He's gonna take another spin. Good luck to you. Come on, Adam. Come on, give me some bullseyes. Come on, you can do it. Give me some bullseyes and stop. Here we go. Two thousand dollars and a bullseye. Good. There you go. Why don't you get there now, buddy? All right, Adam. Now you have two bullseyes up there. Now you have thirteen thousand dollars. You can take the thirteen thousand dollars and walk away, or if you want to be daring, risk it all for your six spin. You go with the odds. Um, I'm gonna, I'm gonna keep going. Good luck to you. Keep going. And jump. Here we go. Another thousand dollars, Adam. Now you have fourteen thousand dollars. Now, if you go all the way to your tenth spin without seeing that lightning, you'll win a million dollars, Adam. But you have fourteen thousand now. Take the fourteen thousand dollars and walk away, or go for your seventh spin. I'm gonna keep going. Good luck to you. Odds are in your favor, Adam. You can go give for it. Bullseyes, give me the bullseye. Give me that bullseye and stop. Another thousand dollars, Adam. You're up to fifteen thousand dollars. Take that fifteen thousand dollars and walk away, or risk it all for your eighth spin. I'm gonna keep going. Good luck to you. Odds are in your favor, Adam. You can do it. Bullseye. Give me that bullseye and stop. Another thousand dollars, Adam. You're making it interesting. Sixteen thousand dollars. Take the sixteen thousand dollars and walk away, or risk it for your ninth spin. Let's let's keep going. Good luck to you. Here we go. Yeah, I think he has lightning. Frozen. Come on, give me that bullseye. Give me that bullseye. Stop. Here we go. Two thousand dollars. Now, here we go. Here's the decision, Adam. Take the eighteen thousand dollars and walk away, or risk it for your ten spin. If you avoid the lightning, you'll win one million dollars. What do you want to do? Um, let's keep going. Okay, this is the final spin. This is for a million two thousand five hundred dollars. Here we go. Come on, Adam! Come on, Adam! Come on, Adam! Don't get lightning. I'll take anything but lightning. Give me something good. Stop. Come on, come on, come on. Yeah, you win a million dollars, Adam. Nice job. Come on, come on. That's how you do it, Adam. Wow, good job, Adam. One million dollars. That takes your total to one million two thousand five hundred dollars, Adam. There was nothing to it but to do it. Now you have a decision. Now, we don't have no decision. The game is over with. <laughs> well, the decision is, take a guess. Where the hell was the lightning? Let's see. Where did you think the lightning was at, Adam? Um, I'm going to probably guess it would be top left. Top yeah, left. Let's see. Yeah, frozen. Yep, that's my guess. Let's see. You're right. There you go. He was safe the whole dog on time. You're time. Well, Adam, you have a million two thousand and five hundred dollars. You're well positioned, and that's all the time we have, guys. Did y'all have a good time? Oh yeah. Yeah. All right, guys. We win on the show. Well, we're gonna uh, sign off here, but this is Riding One Two Seven Nine signing off, saying be safe, be careful, take care, of everybody. And if you want to join the YouTube game and entertainment group, let me know in the comments below, and we'll definitely be happy to have you. Okay. This is Rodney1279 uh, saying, whatever you do in life, make sure you hit the bullseye. Goodbye, y'all. Good job, Adam. Good job, Adam. Oh, for Adam. Oh, the Million Dollar Club. Yeah. Y'all yeah. doing fine in Bonus Island. Yeah. Oh, man.
And all these million dollar wins, it just keeps flying right by. Yeah, we're going to be broke by the end of the season. <laughs> I think we're already broke like over. Yep. This is Kevin Henry speaking for Bullseye, a Roddy1279 production in association with YouTube Games and Entertainment. Oh, Jack Berry generates us. You're available to play tomorrow, Adam? Yeah. Yeah, that was great. Two. I'm glad I'm glad you're happy, Adam. That was great. Yeah, especially me. Yeah, I shut it out yesterday. I think a little shook up by that, but today it's a whole different story. I'm going to try to get some Jeopardy in this evening. I'm behind on my Jeopardy episodes. 